The last time I saw you guys, you were trying to sell me your Sprinter van that you remodeled into a tiny home. Mm-hmm. Yes, we did. And uh, did you sell it yet? Because I because I, I have one. I have a Sprinter van. Yeah, it's much nicer. Yeah, it's yours okay. is oh. sick. Uh, we, we did sell ours. We did yeah. sell it. Yeah. yeah, we sold it to a guy like a guy that fits the part for it. You know what I mean? He was like really into road trips. He wants to like camp in it and everything. And he like paid that. your asking price? Not asking the asking, you? not the asking price. A little bit. Yeah, yeah a little bit like twenty five thousand dollars under that, but F- so that's fine. Fifty you know? k. Yeah. <laughs> What's with the? That's tricky. It's a bit of a pill to swallow. I just like no, I, I know I'm gonna have to swallow this pill with my cool bus. Like, oh yeah. like I love this bus and I want seventy five thousand dollars for it. But I know no fucking idiot is gonna pay that much money. Yeah. I just for that I, bus. I, Somebody I think car, cars are just like I'm not into cars. Yeah. Like so, I can never justify spending money. I, I, I'm glad I learned that at a young age. I brought I bought a Bronco. I was gonna ask you about that. Yeah, we sold, sold that. It. Sold the Bronco. Sold that for probably like forty thousand less than I put into it. <sighs> yeah. Cars are tricky. Talk they about are. a depreciating asset. Worse. Oh, yeah. The worst, man. Bad. They're terrible. That's why Just, I, I used to hate the idea of leasing. But now I kind of like the idea I of leasing. It, my, yeah. my, like, you know, Amara drives the Lambo. It's leased. She, I think she coughed up like 60 racks for like an 18-month lease. But then you give it back. Oh, it's leased? Yeah, it's leased. Oh, she's cap. Yeah. Well, I mean, she's got six other cars that are bought. But she leased. I don't, think, I don't think leasing's cap at all, though. No, no, no. She, nah, but he, it, he it, means it, on terms of her. No, it's talk. just like. Well, it, she said she bought it. Depends, no, she, she depends who nah. you are. You're going to get made fun of. Like, if you're a rapper and you're leasing cars, you're fucked. Well, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. They all are leasing Every rapper, every celebrity is leasing, dude. Cap. No, cap's not. Cap. Okay, but how are they paying? How are they paying taxes? Because we like we've been in the industry for so long. I talked to some like high ups in like record labels and stuff like that. Like we know, I like I know the the rev split between them and like sure. these people are getting fucked over. There's no way they can afford Bro, these things. Of course it, not. it is of the not. longest story in Los Angeles history. Every house you see is rented. Every car you see is leased. It's such a false. Reality it is the idea. most false reality of all fucking time. All of those R8s and Bentleys mm. that drive past you are six months away from going back to the fucking dealership. Honestly, bro. The, the way I Everybody. see it, if it's, if it's not a Tesla, it's not worth it. Wow. Really? Yeah. You really are woke. Ethan. Oh, yeah. He, and, and he, <laughs> Full green. he convinced me on, I'm, I'm switching my car to a Tesla. I have a Porsche right now. I'm switching it to the Model S. So it's like, really? Every Panamera, it's going to go to S. It looks, faster. looks the same. The the, you sure. don't have to drive. You Autopilot. literally don't. We didn't drive here. No, we didn't. Oh, wow. <laughs> we, 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 we're staying in Laguna right now because our house, we, we normally would live seven minutes away, but our house is under construction, so we're in Laguna. Okay. And we just autopiloted all the way here, didn't drive once. Don't you have to put your hands on the steering wheel? <laughs> yeah, you, you got to correct it, but like he didn't actually physically drive. Like he didn't have to. That's crazy. It is like, how do you can't. not have a Tesla yet? I don't understand. Because yeah, I'm, I I'm semi waiting for the new ones to come. I want the Roadster. Mm. The, oh, the, so the fast nice. one, the real fast one. I don't know one. if they gave a date, like when that's going to come out. Then. They did, but then they pushed it, and mm. then because the Cybertruck's now coming out, who knows when? They remember they came out with the uh, the Tesla Semi. Jake, Jake, oh, yeah. put, Jake put a twenty five thousand oh, yeah. dollar payment down payment on the Tesla Semi. I, he said he was he said it was a flex. <laughs> but but the, but the steering wheel is in the middle of the semi truck. Whoa! And I, I wanted to wait for the Roadster to come out because it's a badass car, and everyone already has the what's the one with the wings on the side? That's S. I have. That's S. It's sick, but like I feel like every no no not I feel like every influencer has the Tesla Model S. Because yeah. it's the best. We just we keep it plain Jane though. So it's just yeah. like it's literally just for the convenience sake. Yeah, like yeah. just point A to point B. I'll get it. Drive. Tesla's the future. And it's I'll a lease, like so we're gonna send a say it. You know, no, I, I, I lease all my cars. No, no, because no, no, I'm trying to I wanna I want to change my shit every three that's years. That's what I'm saying. So, so the opportunity to do that. If I pay over a hundred thousand dollars on a car, I'm gonna want the fucking new one in three years. You know what I mean? I'm not gonna want like just the old, like sure four year old. I feel like leasing is good for for like people who can't afford to buy outright and people who can afford to buy outright fifty times over. Like I feel like it's the midsection that it makes sense for people to buy the car, drive it into the fucking ground, and then get another new car. But like if you can afford to pay a high note and lease a car and have the newest model every time it drops, then like why not do that? That's my point of view. There's a yeah. there's a there's an answer to that. I don't know what it, I have not leased. This is not a flex. I have I not leased a I single know. car. Yeah. But I my and my business team there's there's smart people, and I there's a reason behind it. I don't know uh, really, what we, it is. I lease for the write off purposes too. I, some of our stuff is written off because it is yeah, a production. I, that's a production vehicle, the yeah, van. Yeah. Someone but, watching this has the answer to this, I'm sure. And I, yeah. I personally don't. And I've always bought two. Like I like instead of renting apartments or condos, like when I was like, yo, I'm only gonna be here for another two years, I literally would just buy the apartment. Oh, buy really? the yeah. apartment. I still own apartments and rent them out to well, people that's instead I of fuck paying, my vehicles but up. Similarly, that's why uh, I just then just because think about all the like modifications I do and all of that. That's, yes. That's why we, I, we have a Tacoma in Jersey and we bought it. I can't Lease it to come because we're gonna fuck it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. that makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But also, um, 
Oh shit! What was I gonna say? I was gonna say, like, what is the price difference between doing all that shit? Is it even that great? It's pretty. It's pretty bit. I mean, well, not, not like buying and renting, but like overall, like say five years down the line, like is it gonna make that big of a difference if you bought or? or it depends you know what you're mean? doing with your money. I think the benefit of leasing or putting like a down payment and paying the rest off, whether it's like a house and you're paying a mortgage, whatever is it, it is, is because you can now invest or uh put your money somewhere where it can make you money yeah, yeah. right yeah, like I mean, as, as investments yeah that's that's why i would that, well that's why i wouldn't put four hundred thousand dollars down in the car if you could do 50k and then lease the rest and then that other three hundred fifty thousand dollars can yeah, you be collecting exactly. interest in the bank whatever it is yeah. like, that's car, the strategy there mm -hmm. cars are the outlier too like people need to know that like this doesn't apply to houses cars and boats Boats. Oh, oh, boats. Oh, boats. boats are the worst out of all. That was my worst. first vehicle. Yeah. Yeah. Boat? No, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Amazing. How'd you, how'd you go down in Jersey? Jersey? In Jersey. Yeah. Yeah. Dude.